In this video, I want to show you how you can link your credit or your debit card to your PayPal account. Now, I've been getting several requests, especially from my previous video um, on how you can actually link your credit and your PayPal account, your credit and your debit um, card to your PayPal account. And this video became very handy. Now, if you do not have a PayPal account, do not worry. I have created a video where you can create a normal PayPal account. Now, by a normal PayPal account, what do I mean? I mean, a normal PayPal account, if you are someone in the third world country, say you are in Nigeria, Ghana, India, Philippines, Pakistan, you know, any country in the third world nation that has some form of restriction in terms of creating a PayPal account, then you can actually create a PayPal account. I have created a video and it's currently showing up here in the screen and it's also in the description of this video video also i have gone a step further to create a paypal account um a, a video for you to create a british paypal account meaning a uk paypal account with which you can receive funds in in pounds you can receive funds in pounds now there are some limitations with that paypal account or rather some challenges with opening that paypal account which is number one getting a uk address getting a uk phone number you know working around getting a vpn and all that this is usually something people charge about twenty thousand euro or somewhere around fifteen dollars to actually create for you a a uk paypal account but i've actually created that for free for you i've shown you i, I show i created a video that show you how you can do that for free on my youtube channel it is also in the description below so you might want to go on to watch that video if you currently do not have a paypal account or you're trying to upgrade your paypal account or you know go from having a normal paypal account to having a british paypal account all right now for the sake of this video what we're trying to achieve is to actually link our credit or debit card to our paypal account and in few minutes in the next few minutes i'm going to be holding your hands and showing you basically that it's very simple very straightforward however i want you to do something for me if this is your first time on my channel i want you to hit on the subscribe button right go a step further to hit on the notification button such that whenever i drop a video like this you'll be among the very first to get notified all right now without further ado let's hop right in again if you have any question or something you want clarification with you can leave a comment in the comment section so i would actually attend to that for instance this video i'm creating right now is for people who actually came in my comment section and asked that they want to learn how to link their credit and debit card to their paypal account without further ado let's hop right in let me show you how that works so once you log into your paypal account um once you log into your paypal account what you want to do is you want to come here and click on wallet you give it some time to load and once you click on wallet you see add a new card or bank account all right add a new add a card or bank account so link a debit card or credit card so what i want to do is link a credit card in terms of linking your bank account that might be a subsequent video if you're interested in that video you might want to let me know so i can create a video like that for you now um, I have a master's card already, so I'm just gonna go on to um, go on. So they're asking me debit card or credit card. I should enter the digit of my debit card, which I'm gonna be doing shortly. Alright, so they're asking here you gotta pick what type of card you wanna use. So you're gonna select um if you're using um a Visa, MasterCard, American Express, Discover, Mestro, Union Pay, uh Dinners Club, whatever card you wanna use. But in most cases, I'm of the opinion that you actually stick with um a master's card because that works. Now the next thing you wanna do is to actually impute the expiry date of your card. And mind you, the expiry date is quite relevant, so you don't want to miss this. So you enter your expiry date. Sorry that I'm having to block this off. It's very important for security reasons. Now I've been able to enter my security code, so the billing address and all that stuff. So the next thing you want to do is you want to hit on link your bank card. So they're asking me to save my master's card. No thanks. They said your card was declined by the issuing bank. Please try a different card or contact your da your card issuer with questions. Now, the reason why this card was declined is simple. I had previously actually requested for a card uh, from PayPal, which did not work. So I'm just going to try a different card right now. 
So simply what I'm going to do is I'm going to try a different card, um, a different an alternative card, um, and let's see what happens with that card. Of course, it's still a master card. Master card. So here, I get to enter the expiry date. Then I enter my security uh, code. And then I'm going to enter or link my card and see what happens. Um, it says invalid security code, so I'm going to enter my security code again. So you can see you've added your MasterCard, your debit MasterCard, and that's about it. And I have successfully added my debit MasterCard. You can see my MasterCard is showing right here. So the next thing you might want to do in terms of um, um, doing anything in terms of PayPal related is to, you can actually remove this card here. Yeah? You can actually remove this card, which means, <coughs> excuse me, everything about my card is currently showing here, um, the currency, the expiry date, everything is currently showing here. So I can choose to remove my card. You can choose a, preference, pref uh, a preferred way to pay online, set as preferred. Would use this when you shop or send money for goods and services. More about payment preferences. You might want to update your card, which means changing your card to, you know, a more decent card that is accepted or remove your card. Now, very important information is that in terms of PayPal, um, it's important that you get to transact with your card and every time you relate with people or try to um, buy anything using your PayPal account, make sure, be very sure, especially oftentimes where you're trying to buy anything online, a product or something and they are giving you free trials, right? Oftentimes you just quickly enter your PayPal account and um, enter your your email, your, your PayPal email, and then that's about it. Now, be rest assured that if they're trying to debit you, they are going to debit your credit card. So if you have money on your credit card, they are going to eventually charge you. So you want to be very, 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 in fact, you want to be extremely careful not to just enter your PayPal account um, anywhere in terms of um, any app. You're trying to buy a software, buy an app online, be very careful not to just enter your paper, especially when they are promising you, you know, one month free, three days free trial and all that. Oftentimes, immediately after this trial, they get to go on to debit your account, all right? So, I, I, I'm, tr I'm trying to make this clear so that you don't come back eventually and say, oh, um, you taught me to link my, my, my MasterCard to my PayPal account and now I just got debited or whatever. That's, that's going to be your periquetry and um, I won't be responsible for that, all right? So having said that, every time you're linking your PayPal to anything, make sure, make sure that it's a free trial and immediately it's the third day. If it's a three-day trial, you cancel it. If it's, the, if it's a one-week trial, you cancel it immediately. If it's a one-month trial, cancel it immediately so you don't get debited unnecessary. All right, guys, if you feel like I gave you value for your time, you might want to like this video. Um, subscribe to this channel if this is your first time. All right, uh, leave a comment um, if you need any sort of video from me. Um, and then I'll see you in my next video. Thank you.